Hey girls, today we're gonna to be doing a 10 minute Pilates arm workout. The only equipment that you need for this workout today is a set of light dumbbells. I would recommend anywhere from one to three pounds. I promise you don't need any heavier than that because we're gonna keep those arms moving and they are going to burn. So I just wanna remind you, if you're not already subscribed, make sure you subscribe to my channel because I release a new workout every single week and you'll get notified as soon as a workout is live. Also, if you're not already subscribed to the Fitness Collective app, make sure you check that out because there are exclusive full-length workout videos just for you. Plus, you'll get calendars with a new workout every single day and you'll get recipes and a ton of other fun stuff. So, let's get started. We're gonna have our feet hip distance apart. Hold on to those dumbbells. Just roll those shoulders up and back a little bit just to get those shoulders a little bit warm. So remember when we're doing Pilates style exercises, we really wanna focus on the core. So make sure those abs are nice and strong. And then let's reverse those shoulder rolls. Just roll them forward, down, and back. So again, abs are strong, grow tall. Chest is nice and open. Two more and bring it down. So soft little bend in those knees so you're not locking those knees out. Abs are strong just like a plank. Pull that corset in through those abs so the belly button is pulling in towards your spine. And we're gonna hold on to those weights with the palms facing forward. Soft bend in the elbows and here we go. You're gonna lift those arms up in front and then lower it back down. Exhale, you lift. Inhale, back down. So it's kind of like a little scoop shape with your arms. You have a teeny little bend in your elbows, but you're hinging from your shoulders to lift those arms up. Good, exhale, you lift, inhale, back down. You're gonna hold it up in three, two, last one, hold it. From here, you're gripping those weights, elbows are shoulder height, you bicep curl in and extend. Curl and extend. Grow taller, abs pull in tighter each time you exhale, good. Extend, feel length in those arms as you extend it out. Try and feel those triceps, good. You have three. We're gonna hold in two. Last one you hold. Little punches up to the ceiling for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four. Hold it in three, two, one. Hold it right here, rotate those palms in. You're gonna open and close, open and close. Think of squeezing those shoulder blades in the back, draw your shoulders out of your ears, and then as you bring those arms in front, you squeeze it in front. So squeeze back, squeeze front. You have three, hold it open in two. Last one, hold it here. Both arms press overhead and down, press and down, press and down. So these movements are mimicking exercises that you would see on the reformer. And down, and down. You have three, two, last one. Hold that goal pose shape. Just that right arm is going to press for 10, nine, eight. Stay strong through that opposite arm. Good, exhale, you press right overhead. You have five, four, Three, hold it in, two. Last one, hold your goal post. Other arm, you press and down, press. Stay strong, shoulders draw down. Here's six, push for five, four, three. Hold it in, two. Last one, hold your goal post. Bring those arms together. You have a 90 degree bend. Elbows and forearms are together. You pulse it up for 10, nine eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and down. Whew. Are you feeling those shoulders? I told you, you don't need any heavier than three pounds. You will feel this right away. All right, roll those shoulders up and back. From here, you're gonna have a little arm bend. So you have a bend in the elbows, palms facing in like you're hugging a giant beach ball down below. From here, you're gonna lift those arms up to shoulder height and down. You lift and down. Draw your shoulders down so you're working those shoulders again, just in a little different shape here. <sighs> Stay strong in those abs, grow taller through the crown of your head. Collarbone nice and open. Good, you hold in three, 
two. Hold it here. From here, you open and close. Open and close. This is hug a tree in Pilates, or it's just like a chest fly if you are more used to using dumbbells. You have five. We're gonna hold it closed in four, three, two. Hold it closed at shoulder height right here. From here, you lift and down. You lift and down. Just working those shoulders, again, a little bit differently. As those arms go up, draw your shoulder blades down. You keep that nice roundness in those arms. And down. You lift and down. Whew. Those shoulders are burning. Two. Hold it up there. Last one. From here, open out to the side. Hold that little bend in the elbows. You lift it back up. Down. You lift it up. Down. And up. So now you're hugging a moon. So those arms stay nice and rounded. Hug the moon. Shoulders drop down. Here's three. Hold those arms out and open for two. Last one, open those arms, extend those fingers, drop your shoulders down, circle those arms back for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Reverse those circles for 10, we get a rest next. Here's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, bring it down. Whew. Roll those shoulders up and back a little bit. You ladies are doing amazing. All right, we're gonna change it up a little bit. So feet still hip distance apart. We're gonna hinge over at the hips. Knees are slightly bent, stick that booty out. Palms are facing in towards each other. You're hinged over here. You pull those elbows up and down. So a nice narrow row here. Exhale, you squeeze and down and down. Really feel that shoulder blade drop down your back as you lift. So you wanna make sure that you're not tensing up your neck. It's all about those back muscles. Keep those elbows lifted in two. Last one, you hold. Extend those arms back for a little triceps and bend. Press it back and down. You squeeze and down. So again, those light weights are still making those shoulders move, those shoulders burn, those arms burn. <sighs> So you don't need much. You could do this without weights too. Here's two. Last one, hold. Rotate those palms up to the ceiling. You lower it down, press it back. Down, press and squeeze. So this is a little chest expansion here. And down, squeeze those shoulder blades. You'll feel some triceps, some upper back muscles. Open up the chest, expand through the collarbone every time you press those arms back. Hold it back in two. Last one, hold. Pulse those palms in towards each other for 10, nine, eight, seven. Squeeze those shoulder blades. Here's three, two, hold it. Little circles back for 10, nine. Roll those shoulders back, reach those arms back. Ooh, it's burning. Here's five, four, three, two, reverse for 10, nine. We get a rest, I promise. Here's five, four, three, two, one, and down. Whew. Oh my goodness. Whew. Feeling those muscles here. We are almost done. So from here, we're gonna go into salute. So we're gonna again, hinge it forward. Not so much this time, but just a little hinge forward. Bring those arms up, fingertips together, elbows are wide. So you have those fingertips together, the weights are holding in between those thumbs. You're gonna press it out and up and down. Press it out and up and down. So this is a very traditional Pilates arm exercise here. Draw those shoulders out of your ears. You're gonna feel the shoulders, those triceps. You have four, three, two. You come to the forehead. Last one, hold those arms out. Bring those palms in. You can clasp those hands together and then bend at the elbows, pull it straight. Bend, pull straight. <sighs> Little tricep extensions here. You straighten and squeeze. <sighs> you have four, three, two, one, and down. Oh my 
Gosh, are you feeling those arms? Whew, those shoulders, biceps, triceps, back muscles, everything. Let's put those weights down. We've got one last exercise. We are doing Pilates push-ups. They're military style push-ups, which means those elbows stay nice and narrow. We're gonna bring it down and we're gonna find a nice, beautiful plank position. You can do this on your knees, I promise. That's still plenty hard here and I will show that. Hands right underneath those shoulders. You hold a nice, beautiful plank. Again, a Pilates staple exercise here. Abs are strong. Back is nice and long. Hands right underneath those shoulders. You lower it down, push it up. Keep those elbows nice and narrow. Here's that knee push up. Make sure you're still strong in a nice, beautiful knee plank. Just four more. Here's three, two, last one, and down. Amazing job, ladies. Let's take a little child's pose, stretch out those arms. Big inhales, nice long exhales. Shake out the head no or yes. One more breath here. And then roll it all the way up. Roll those shoulders up and back. And you ladies are finished. I'm so proud of you. Again, if you like this workout, make sure you subscribe. Check out the Fitness Collective app. There are plenty of workouts there that you will love. I'll see you in the next workout.